JSON LD talk talks about how we can bridge the web that we have and the future web, which are really the same web, but there's this perspective that data sets expressed in data formats like RDF and the other semantic web technologies are too hard for people to use or don't work well with the various visual frameworks and user interfaces that sort of, quote, average developers are using. JSON-LD, as a bridge technology, helps us uh, connect these two worlds together in fairly easy and trivial ways and produce a very powerful way of turning semantic web data into JSON in ways that people who don't care about the linkage don't have to care about the linkage, and people who do care about the linkage are still able to do so. So we're going to look at the format and the various ways of bridging it, signing it, framing it, using it, converting to and from various formats, and tying it into some of these uh, user interfaces. So come on and find out how we can connect the future web with the current web using a very simple and reusable data structure called JSON-LD. Uh -huh.